Hey, what's going on? Travis Patel here in Crushing E-Commerce. In this video, we're gonna talk about setting up your customer support on your store. Now, this is very, very important for making money and having a successful business and a quality brand because you're gonna have disgruntled customers and you're gonna have systems that mess up and shipping that doesn't get right and packages that break and just all this type of stuff is going to happen no matter how good your business is. So you have to have a, a quality system for handling these type of situations so that it runs smoothly and that your business doesn't get a bad name. There's nothing worse than you know cursing out an upset customer for no reason. That's only gonna hurt your business name and cause another person never to buy from you again. So you want to be a great quality presence in this customer support, but you can also use the, this type of interaction to help make sales. You can help people not get refunds and not do chargebacks, so you're keeping your money there. You can help people actually decide that they want to make that purchase, and you can even do things like suggest related products or upsells that they may enjoy as well. So all of these are opportunities that you can have for your customer support um, to reply and, and, and get the that, you know, more money in or losing less from just having the right system in place. So there's a lot of different ways that we have customer support set up. Um, first off, obviously a customer support email is very important and we want that listed on our website you know, pretty easily as well as make a contact page that we can have in the navigation bar for our customers and our viewers to contact us. So. For customer support, like I said, there's lots of options. Um, always before I've used Zendesk, which is a great uh, a great provider. You can always just set up a uh, an email too and have that and directly reply to that. Zendesk helps really optimize the whole system. That's a weird video there, but the whole system of getting customer support emails. You can have macros so it replies easily. Something you definitely want to outsource quickly in your business because it's always typically the same three to five problems that customers have. So if you template out the response, as we'll talk about in the later modules on outsourcing, then you can make it a very simple process for anyone to follow. And Zendesk is a cool little help, uh, support desk system that you can use for your store. Now another one that I've just heard about, I'm actually gonna set up with the Don Mazuma store here, is called Reamaze, and this works right in Shopify and does a very cool thing where it actually adds in live chat too for extra, which I was gonna talk about later, I'm gonna talk about later in the video, where we do want a live chat feature set up on our store, and just, just another way, like I said, to communicate with that audience member, answer questions quickly, and convince them to purchase. So, we're gonna go ahead and sign this up, but definitely you want to have a customer support desk up as soon as possible, um, just because of all the customers that are going to be contacted, even if they just have questions about the product and they want to buy, that you're in to, uh, to make the sale. Let's go ahead with We'll do that. 14 day trial here. I've heard really good things about this one. All right, so set up web integration. Cool. All right, so yeah, this is just kind of the support desk of how it's gonna look like. Someone's going to message you, you have the customer support ticket to respond to, and you answer their question as needed. So definitely get that customer support up in the next sections. Like I said, we'll dive into kind of responses. Um, we have some templates on what's gonna happen in your stores when you have you know, refund policies and uh, delivery issues and things like that. So that's definitely something you wanna put into play. Um, you want to, as soon as possible, add this contact information to your store. So you can actually set up a contact page. Whereas if you go into online store, pages, We'll add a contact page. Contact us here. And then you can add your email for the Reamaze or the Zendesk. Um, or there's also apps out there that have it as kind of a, a submit form process, which we will add later on. 
So these are all very important pieces. Need that customer support, need that rocking in there. Like I said, the live chat is also um, pretty handy because just on the front page, you'll have a little box in the bottom right corner that can pop up. People can ask questions anytime. The Reamaze has this built in if we add, you know, it's a little bit more per user. Um, but then if we're not going to use that, you're probably going to have to use an app or have it self built for you. So I know, what is that one? Zoom. Zopin. This is a good, this is uh, one of the good live chat ones I've seen out there. And this is kind of what it looks like on the bottom right. And if you have someone online during the day, they can answer questions right away or it'll leave a message for you later to respond to. So customer support, very important. Get your support desk in there. Get your contact page on your website. Get the customer support email and then get the live chat. And that is exactly what you want to have in place and going on your store. Now, another great way to kind of avoid customer support issues is that you can add an FAQ page on your store, a frequently asked questions page. And what you can do is any all the problems that occur during your store while you're getting buyers coming in, all the customer support desk tickets that come in, you'll have a template response to each of these problems that occur so you can just add that to the FAQ on a page and you can also add that FAQ onto your sales page as a little drop down which is always very effective because then buyers can get those answers to those questions without having to contact your support desk without having to take the time to reply and all that stuff you'll just have it right in front so contact page about uh, our live chat page um, or excuse me live chat on the store about us page the FAQ page and the customer support desk setup. Those are very important just to get people going uh, and be able to answer all their questions and make more sales. So get them up as soon as possible and move on to the next video.